Right. Officials would not tell us those other airports that person traveled through to get here to Madison. And an employee tonight told me that he knows they're going to be sanitizing the entire airport after we leave tonight. But other than these hand sanitizing stations here that are traditionally throughout the airport, we're not seeing any visible precautions that they're taking. We heard a mix of responses to the confirmed coronavirus case in Dane County Wednesday on UW's campus. It's a virus. We can deal with the virus. I was so worried because, you know, my mother is a nurse in China and he asked me to wear a mask every day to protect myself. And to the Dane County Regional Airport. I guess it's one of those things where, again, it's something I can't control, mm -hmm. you know, so no matter what I can do. So you're not going to worry about it? No, I'm not going to worry about it. I've seen uh, people in the airport uh, wearing masks. I flew from di different airports until I got here, and that worries me. Officials would only say the confirmed case is an adult who traveled to Beijing, where they came into contact with people from Wuhan. After arriving at Dane County Airport last Thursday, the patient felt sick, got tested, and immediately isolated themselves in their home. We are in touch in with this person every day, making sure that they're staying home. We ask them if they need any supplies. Um, and if they do, then we work to provide those supplies. Mayor Satya Rhodes Conway insists the threat to other Dane County residents remains very low, but she and health officials say more cases are likely. I think we need to realize that we have an emerging health condition that we're all monitoring um, globally and locally. So um, I think we'd be remiss to think that this is the only um, case that we might ever have, and that could be something that could happen um, at any point in time. Caroline, with that in mind, what are they doing to prepare for the possibility of more cases? Well, the mayor here says that they have people here who are trained and ready if more coronavirus cases are confirmed. They also have a hotline here that people locally can call daily for updates and questions. The number to that hotline is on your screen. It is 608-243-0587.